Is this what it is? Is that what it is? <laughs> Barbie Extra Fashion Pack Action. Hi, welcome to Doll Juice. Today you are with me and we are going to do a little unboxing. Yeah, um, that's what we're going to do. This is so nice. This is just a cup of coffee that I've made. And we're all done. Okay, so... This is a Barbie Extra Fashion Pack. This is also another Barbie Extra Fashion Pack. It says on the bottom of these that they were trademarked, copyrighted in 2021. I'm sure they came out about late 2021-ish. Um, they're really cool. They are typically around about $14.99 to buy, typically. I bought them for like between seven and eight pounds separately from different sellers online. I was super happy with that, right? Um, to be honest, I'm not so much of a fan of the pet that comes with this. I don't understand the purpose of the plastic hair thing and I don't understand the purpose of this strand of hair either. Doesn't really make a whole lot of sense to me, but I'm sure it'll be fun anyway, and we'll see what that's like. Um, I mainly got it for the like, like little handbag, it's quite cute, and I got it for this top because I think that I love zipper tops, and to actually have one that's got a functioning zipper is like everything. On the back, it just says colours and decorations may vary, and then it's got a little picture of the different things that you can do with the pet if you so desire. Um, this one comes with this sort of like dressing robe, gown, whatever, house coat, however you want to call it, that's what it comes with. Um, for me, you know, it can also be used on spa days and things for Barbie, whatever it is that she wants to do. This is her like lounging gear, right? We've got like a little um, glass of juice or a cocktail. It depended on Barbie's mid that day. Um, we have like an orange shaped bag. And then we've got the pet. For this one, I think this pet is actually quite strong. It's very, very cute. So what I would say is, although this doesn't look like a real pet, this could be used as like, you know, some sort of like ornament that Barbie has in her home, like a vinyl art piece, something along those lines, right? And then it comes with pineapple eyewear for the pet. And then the pet also comes with its own strawberry donut ring, which is actually pretty cute. I think they could have been stronger on the pet aspect to this but then I'm sure there's a lot of people um, that will actually agree with me in the way where there could have just been more accessories. So we could have had this, we could have mm -hmm. had like a towel and some like bath items here and then we could have also had um, some shoes or some slippers or like an eye mask. We usually get these in travel accessories, but something a little bit different would have been nice, like bottles of eye cream and stuff. You know, they can make these things without having to make pets, but these are aimed at kids. And so maybe there's a big thing just now and the market kind of is control of kids like things with pets. I don't know. Um, for me, as a collector, I really don't really care that much. Some of the pets are quite cute, to be fair, but I've had to choose between a pet and some real accessories. I'm going to choose the accessories. On the back of this, it just shows you, of course, um, the little cat with the glasses on and stuff, which is cute. The only thing about this drink, though, in the front, is that it doesn't have a handle for Barbie to hold. But she can, if you have like one of those little temporary glue dots, that will work perfect for blue tack. Whatever you use, that should work fine. Just do not use super glue, because super glue is like forever. So don't use that with plastic. It will also help to burn the plastic. Just anything temporary will work. Um, so yeah, and I love the picture that they've got here of this Barbie Extra as well. I will show you this Barbie Extra and I'm going to use her along with these outfits. Along with uh, another Barbie Deluxe Extra, which I didn't unbox on camera. But I'm here to show you her anyway. So here are my Barbie Extras that I'm going to use with Barbie Extra sets. So I've got this girl here. Um, she is this one that's on the box but I straightened out her hair when I say I straightened it I boil washed it I don't ever use straighteners or anything like 
I don't use any heat styling tools on my doll's hair because it's never worked out well. It always fries them, so I don't know how people use them. I've tried it on their hair when it's wet, it just fries and doesn't work. So boil wash just helps straighten her hair out pretty much completely. Um, and I love how this looks. But I also like how this looks as well. It's very, very cute. Um, but yeah, she just she just really, really suits how this looks. I think she just looks absolutely gorgeous. And then I have this girl here as well. So she is Barbie Extra from the Deluxe Pack, the Fancy Pack. But she is, again, I just redid her hair. I completely shaped her bangs. I had to like cut some hair out so that it would lay a little bit flatter. But I did get it eventually how I wanted to go and I'm not going to go any further because I think it's pretty perfect how it is, to be honest. I think I've done a good job. I did take her earrings out. They were annoying me. Her hair was tangling up in them and it just wasn't a pleasure to work with. So I decided just to take them out. Um, who are we going to do? So this girl here, because she's on the front of this. So who's on the front of this? Ah, so we do have a Barbie on the front of this one. So do you see it's the one that has like the periwinkle coloured hair? But I don't have her. I don't want her jimply because like she has that really bad, awful propylene hair. Propylene? Was it propylene or <sighs> some sort of hair eh, that's just not good? But see, her hair is very, very super soft, as is hers. So just those girls are going to slay in these clothes today. Right, let's just take some thumbnails and then we'll get back on this. So let's just get on this, shall we? Um, we're now going to unbox. So I bought this one first before the other one. What? Oh, wow, this is actually a very, very good experience. I did not, I'm surprised. This came off the full packaging without disturbing it really at all. This could be used as a really cool backdrop. I am 100% keeping this because, um, hello. How is that? That's, that's, that's going to work. That is, yeah, 100%. I wonder if this one's going to do the same. Oh, this would be so cool if it did. And there's tape on the bottom, so going to try. Oh, this might... oh no, will it work? I don't know. I don't think it will, you know. Mm. No. I tried. I just, I just, I guess I was just super lucky. So some of it has come off. I could paint it in. But still, that would still work, right? And actually, I've got a really cool idea. So with the Barbie extra like stickers that I've got, I could place them on here too. So really, I've got two different backdrops. It's quite cool. That that's gonna work. That that is that is gonna work. Right. So this one first. So obviously we've got this. Now it is held in at the back by some little tabs and stuff like that. So just bear with me while I do the unboxing. Oh. Oh, so there's a whole different case of this. Interesting. Ah. Okay, I'm liking this. So this actually has its own little plastic mould on the inside. And it's constructed really well. So that's interesting. It's got its own little mould there, which is quite cool. I don't see me keeping that, to be honest. Um, so let's look at the construction of the garment, shall we? So, it is sewn all the way down, which is nice. This is really super soft and fluffy. This is also sewn all the way down. And the construction is pretty nice. There's no lining, but it doesn't really need to be. Of course that would be great if they did but there's not and then we have like little cherries on the back very very cute i love this a lot so we're going to put this on our girl just the way that she is just now to see what this looks like because i just think this is a perfect like outfit that would kind of work with the colors that she's wearing um it might not be absolutely perfect but i think it was just it's nice so let's have a little look 
how long have I got? Okay. Um, I just don't have a lot of memory here on my phone, so I'm just trying to like be aware of what kind of memory I actually have. I'm also aware of the fact that I don't have a Bluetooth headset on. And I'm hoping that this is actually going to come out with a decent volume. I, I really do. Um, because my last recordings I've used my Bluetooth earphones and like you could hear me really well. Um, but this one I don't know if you can, so we will do, I will do my best, best to see that this audio quality is going to be good enough for you to hear. Because she's just chilling and she doesn't always want her body to always be shown, especially if it gets a little bit later at night and she's just chilling outside in the summer. Yeah. Yeah. So you just don't come all the way down to the bottom. I would have liked a longer sleeve on that, but that is what it is, I guess. Very, very cute. Very, very, very cute. Really, really cute. Love this. How could you not love that? Right, let's see it tied at the front. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Yep. What do we think? Do we like it? Does it look good? I think it looks good. I think it looks fantastic. So cool, right? Absolutely love this. She is 100% queen. I love this doll. If they were doing this on sale, I would 100% get her. Like, they, I have got her on sale, but I'm going to wait for a wee bit until I do get her because I've still got the additional Barbie looks to get. The new wave, the black girl, I want to get her. She's gorgeous as well, but yeah, this girl is just something else. She, I didn't like her when I first got her and I was a bit disappointed. But see that I've styled her myself and stuff. I think she's, I really brought, to me, I brought out the full potential that I could see in her. And I just, I just, I just love her. I think she's gorgeous in this fit. Now, Miss Malibu, it's time for your upgrade, honey. This is probably not going to be the best fit. But I'm going to play around with this a little bit and see what we can come up with. When I say we, I mean I. Um, so this is a dress from, I don't know if it will fit her though. No, it might not. This is from one of the Barbie um, birthday wishes. And I'm choosing this to go with this bit here because it's got, like blue and purple. It might be cute. I don't know. I'm just playing about. Um, I didn't actually look at the rest of the pack, which is stupid, so... Let's just look at the rest of the pack first for that girl that we've just shown. So here we have the orange bag that she comes with. So let's just take a look at her and see. I don't know what I'm going to call her though. I really don't. I need to start giving all my Barbies names and then creating a little book of them. I really do. I'm just going to hold her bag like this. Purse first, purse first. <laughs> Purse first, purse first. Walk into the room, purse first. Ow. <laughs> Please don't copyright me for that. Um, and then we have the little drink. Very detailed, actually. Just wish I had a little extra handle. Would have been so cute. We have like an orange or a slice of lemon. Slice of lemon, right? And then we've got, so this is like fruit inspired, I'm sure. Because we've got cherries, orange, lemons. Um, strawberries and pineapples. It's all cute. The donut ring. It's a decent weight. I like it. You know, and this is the thing though, like I'm sure that Shelly and things, Chelsea or whatnot, can use these. I'm sure. Is it gonna work? Is it gonna work? Is it gonna work? No. But she, no it's not. But like, she could pre she could pretend, right? She could she could pretend. Yeah, it works. It works. It's workable. It's our imaginations that make that work. Styling, right? How cute. Some weight to them as well, which is quite nice. The head doesn't move, but really cute and there's actually flocking on the top of the cat which is very unusual i've not seen that before from mattel and does have mattel on the bottom not all of these pets have mattel but 
Do you see like where he has like flocking here on the back? All those stripes are flocked, which is pretty cool in itself by the way. I really like this little pet, it's very cute. It's very cute. So, does he just like go on his little donut ring or like how does this work? Does he just how does how does this how does this go on him? Like does he put him does he work like that? I don't know. Like how do you get him to fit inside? What does it? How? Where is? Right, it's here. How does it work? So he's sitting on it. So like he's sitting on it, but he's not inside it. And it's like to the side. So like that. Okay, well that works, like he's looking up at the sun, right? Okay. Um, yeah, there needs to be like a new Barbie extra fashion pack coming out with a basically like a bit more to it. So what he said, that is pretty cute, but to be honest, like it is. I'm not going to sit here and say that it isn't. I'll just balance them on this cardboard so you can see a bit better. Okay, that is pretty cute, right? Yeah, it is. I can see that being cute in the Barbie house. Uh, absolutely good. Okay, so that's done and dusted. Let's get her fit on, right, shall we? So let's take her little original pet away. This is like one, I'm sure this is a Barbie pet. I'm not sure. I'm sure it is. This is quite heavy as well. And I just bought this on a, in a bundle online, so I don't really know what like, oh, where it comes from. So let's just see if this whole skirt thing is actually going to fit her. Um, I just think this combination would be quite cute. Strange but cute, right? Certainly not the usual way. And it does fit her. That's fine. It's fine. So now we've got the skirt on. This might look cute actually, because she's meant to be extra. So let's just play along with that fantasy and see what happens. No. So they do have those annoying tags on the inside that do kind of disrupt the material a little bit. There's no like holder for it so that's fine. Um, it's those little ones here. I haven't done a lot of disruption so far really. It's not that bad but I'm not the biggest fan of it to be honest. But it's, it's not that it's nothing noticeable. Right. I need a top for her though to see if this would work. No I don't really because she could be total rebel right. She could just decide to not have anything underneath so that that's the way that's going to go I don't know, put it this way, if you want to see more doll photography and stuff like that then here's, here's my pitch go down to the description box and there you will see a link to my insta and that's where you will find all the photography that I do um, I do a lot of decent stuff like it, but I would like more to be more people to join. So if you join, that'd be cool, right? I am impressed that there's an actual working zipper on this. I think that's next level stuff, to be honest. And it doesn't look too big either. It looks like a decent size. Oh, well, let's put our hair through the hole. So there's a hole in the back of the hood. It's weird. Like, I get why they do it, but see in real life, you do know that this would be entirely like dysfunctional. Like there's there's no reason for that to be because your hair is still gonna get wet. Um this is just it just works for photography so there's not a lot of bulk in the back, I think. Nah, it doesn't work with this dress. I like this. It's quite cute, right? Doesn't work with that skirt at all, but yeah, so the hole in the back. Um it's cute. But It doesn't quite work on this doll, I don't think. I don't know. There's something about her that just doesn't seem to really work with her. 
I'm feeling like I want to try a different girl and I don't know who to try. Let me try this one. So she is the holiday travel doll. I've not done a review for, but she actually might work for this a bit better. So let's have a little look. In fact, I'm sure it will because the colours that are included within her. I just think, I don't know, I feel that this doll looks too fancy for this. Like she looks too put together. How can I, does that make sense? She just looks a little bit too perfect. Like this looks good on her right. But her hair is like, I don't know, her hair is precisely done. Not that the other girls isn't, but it's just not given the kind of look that I want. Like she's very much, which suits the original outfit that she came in what with her PVC leather stuff. Looks better than this on her. So that's the thing. Not all dolls are going to suit everything. And it is a preference and taste in what you like. Um, so let's try it with her. I think I'm going to have better luck this time, hopefully. I think I will. I think that looks a bit better. I don't know. I don't know. I can see why they put this on the other Barbie extra doll because these little periwinkle colours will go with her hair but I have a few other Barbie extras when I get a few oh, Barbie extras that I'm going to try this on and we can actually see what this looks like um but it's looking better on her I think I just want to maybe give her some jeans or something that's going to work a bit better with it I feel that that's maybe the better way to go I don't know 100% do I have any other jeans? I should do. I should do. I don't know where they are. Right, so let's look at what else comes in the accessory pack. So she has this handbag, which is pretty cute. And it's all around and it is quite heavy. I don't know why they make them so heavy, but they do. So she's like, yeah, I can't, I don't have articulation really, so I can only do this with my bag. Yeah. The pet. is an absolute weirdo. Because he doesn't move his head, but he's a little lamb. They're still pretty cute. Again, could be used as like a vinyl ornament or something. Then we have these pieces, which they don't make any sense to me. And I'm going to try this on Shelly to see what happens, right? Because Shelly could dress up too. When I say Shelly, I mean Chelsea. So that works, sort of. That's pretty cool, actually. Right? So <laughs> that works because she's like a love Lady Gaga and I want to look like her. And this is it. That's a bit dated, is it not? Because Lady Gaga had this when she first came out. I don't understand. But it's very... I want to be Lady Gaga, Barbie. I want to be Lady Gaga. Um, so you put this on the top of the doll. Of the puppy. And actually it looks quite cute. And then it becomes looks like that. And then you get this other bit on the inside. It's just a a hair thing wrapped around a piece of plastic secured by a couple of elastic bands and you put this into the so you've got this peg, right, and then you put the peg into the inside and then it's like in the shape of a little flower and then it looks I I don't know why. I don't know why, and anyone that has been on YouTube looking at these reviews has probably said the same thing. Why? 
what does this do for a kid? I'm going to tell you, is this what it is? Is that what it is? I whip my hair, like this is so old. If this is based on what it is, like I whip my hair back and forth, then fair enough, I could see this being cool, right? But for me, if I was a kid, this would not consume my attention. Like, you could do this all day long, but you could do that with anything, really. Like, it could be extra sassy, but I'm not, like, I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling this. This is a no in my book. This is an absolute no. No. Um, they could have marketed this hairpiece to work on Chelsea. And I had this along with the set. I don't know. I just think the first set was stronger than the second set. The first set with the pet. Like this pet here compared to this one. It's just, it's it's not comparable, right? It's This one looks better than this one. Even with the eyewear taken off of the pet. It looks better. Like this pet comes with better accessories. It's also flocked on those little um stripes it has his own little donut ring he has his own glasses and he's got his own drink i think that's better than one that comes with a random peg and a bit of hair sticking out of it and this weird plastic thing and also what you do is as well oh so you, you've got like a three in one really so you can do this put that on top and then put this there so there's a hole on the top of it and then you put this on top and then why what, what does that mean does that what does that do what does that why what is the what is the reason what is the reason behind this someone needs to tell me why because it doesn't make any sense at all no none whatsoever as i said like shelly can wear this she can be weird in the dollhouse because she's a little girl and that's fine. Like she can do all these little strange things because so she's cute and and it is what it is. Like look, that works, right? Because you just get a bit of bulky hair in the back, but you could fix it to actually totally work. And that looks cute, right? That looks fun. Okay, the pet wearing it doesn't make any sense. Right, so it doesn't make any sense at all. That's my two cents on that. Uh, I want to try more like jeans and stuff on her to see what's actually going to work with this outfit though. Um, I think this looks quite cute the way that it is with Barbie here. Just a classic Barbie though. You know, it, it, it does work to a point, I think. Um, I just, you know, she needs the bottom bit to be covered up to really look right. What I'm going to do though is, I want to give you a sneak peek. I've got this Barbie looks doll that I've yet to unbox for you, but I've already unboxed one. Reason being is that she does have, it looks like she's got a decent part in, parting in her hair. So, I want one to have her hair down, I want to have her hair up. I know it's weird, but it's what I want to do. So, I'll give you a sneak peek. This is one of the Barbie looks dolls. I don't remember the number of her, but here she is. Now, she looks like she's got on the right colours for this, and it might work. But it is a bodycon dress, so it might not. We're just going to see. And she's also petite, so these are regular girls. Well, she's a regular and then a curvy, right? So we're going to see what it looks like on a petite. And I think this might actually look quite cute. Just let's have a look and see. So, kind of works on her. I'd say it looks better on her than it does the others, right? And I did. There is a lot of, like, sort of, there's some room in this, but there's meant to be because it's a hoodie. Um, so it's not too much, it's okay on a petite. I think the colours really work with this and I like how that looks on her. I'm not carbon focus. So the overall she looks the best in it with the colours that she's wearing and she looks like she's super casual as well. Um, I just think it looks better because she is fully covered here. And I would change the shoes but I like how this looks. So that can work. So this kind of colour scheme looks good. And then if she opens up her jacket... It looks even better. Yeah. 
I really like that. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this review. I hope you found it interesting. I hope if you're looking to buy these, then you are happy with your purchase. I hope this has been helpful in helping you decide if you want to buy them. But yeah, those two gorgeous beauties they really, really suit them. I think they've, I, I think this one worked really well. She's got the colours that work with the hoodie. It looks like a whole outfit. It looks good. It's kind of it's workable, right? It's workable. Okay, so thanks for watching, guys. Um, again, if you want to see more content, doll photography and everything else, just go to the link down below in the description. If you don't want to miss any more of my uploads, you know the drill. Just press the... Sorry, I had a phone call there that I had to take. It's actually really, really good news. Um, so yeah, if you liked my video here and you enjoyed my content with these girls and you liked how I dressed them, but you want to see more stuff, then all you need to do is go to the description down below and there you will be able to see um, my link in the bio. Also, um, to not miss any more uploads from me, then just hit the subscribe button, the notification bell, and you will be notified when that bell rings when I next upload. Also, let me know your thoughts on this. Comment down below. I'd love to see what you think. And if you liked it, then hit on that like button. It lets me know that you enjoy my content. Thanks for watching and take care of yourself. Enjoy the rest of your day or evening, whatever it may be. Ciao.